for fun tips and cool information, tune in to HealingTalks.com. I started off with about a liter. I'll do about a third carrots, a third apples, and maybe a third greens. And that's just because I try to get people interested in the flavor of it, and that's a good route to go. Throw in a twist of lime, it brings up all the the flavor. Uh Yeah, yeah, yeah. So throw in about a third of apple juice, Uh a third of carrot juice, Uh and a third of greens. So it's going to be nice and sweet. Yes, yes. And then you add add a twist of lime. And a twist of lime. Right. So for the greens that you want to try, there's a couple different ones you can choose from. Spinach is going to be an easy one to tolerate, but it's going to make you go to the bathroom. Wow. So usually uh-huh. it's a hard one for people to start off with, right. and it'll turn them away from it. Right. Chard is a very creamy, smooth, wow. easy, tolerable wow. green. Wow. Uh-huh. Kale is a little bit more strong, right. and for somebody who doesn't really appreciate uh-huh. greens, they probably right. won't want right. the juice. Uh-huh. So that is your greens. They well, would like kale. Collins. What about regular yeah. dark greens? You know, lettuce. Lettuce has a little bit different taste no. that you kind of got to watch out for. Yeah. Uh-huh. So it just it reminds me of grass. Uh-huh. So like it lettuce. just depends on no, what you no, like. No. As your taste buds adapt, right. Right. you'll improve and adjust, right. and actually right. everything starts to taste great. Yeah. So one of the main things, let's talk about juice in here. That's okay. what we're here for. Yes. Right. So there's the different kinds of juicers. You have a centrifugal juicer, right. which is going to spin. Right. You have a twin gear or an right. auger, which right. is going to basically right. press the juice with right. two gears. Right. And you have a press. Right. perfect example of a press is a Norwalk juicer. It's extremely well, but extremely expensive. $2,700. Yes. Yeah. So the, the centrifugal juicer, the juicer will come down, and as it's feeding down the chute, it will spin and tear off chunks of fruit and vegetables, and it will sling it out a basket and separate the juice. This is fantastic for somebody who's having a difficult time right. finding the energy or the okay. amount of time available for their schedule. At the same time, this also oxygenates the juice, and it would be about 25% of the nutrients compared to a press juice. Wow. An yeah. auger or a twin gear juicer will give you a noticeable amount more energy wow. than a centrifugal. Right. It may take a little bit more right. work, right. but it'll be much more efficient at right. greens and leafy vegetables, right. and you'll get much more of your money and make it back. Uh-huh. A press is the best way to go. Okay. For right. somebody like me that okay. has you, such a back you were, issue. You were just yeah. ten, technically disabled. Once you start yes. drinking juice, you're able to function and pretty you, much. And you yes. can feel the difference, which means it's very separate between the three day. types night of juices. Day. You know, our local store had one of these centrifugals, and I told them I refused to buy their juice anymore. Right. And they got an auger one just so they could give me juice. I, if there's an option, yeah. I will not buy store-bought juice, the centrifugal, just right. because right. it doesn't give me the same kick when I have pressed. Right. Right. Now, if you don't have that ability, then any centrifugal juice is definitely better right. than nothing, right. and it's still fantastic. Right.